I can't give you a precise uh, estimate or what we could call a mass balance of the oil in terms of what percentage uh, evaporates, what percentage is... Together with five agencies, federal and state agencies, we have assessed and verified pipeline data and made a determination that the minimum amount of crude oil released from that pipeline is 588 barrels of oil. We are working on a, an, a precise estimate, uh, but right now, just based on, on the calculations of the five agencies that reviewed and verified, uh, the, the minimum release number is the number we have right now. And I, and I would expect that number to change. Um, I don't expect it to change significantly, uh, but it, it will continue to be refined. But we know as an absolute minimum that amount of oil was released into the environment. So the oil that we do have offshore right now is in the form of streams or ribbons. We call it sheen. Uh, we're not seeing a lot of heavy product, a lot of dark patches of oil. Um, uh, you know, in terms of oil movement, we're talking about a huge area of the ocean, and, and that oil spreads, um, spreads wide and far. And as it's exposed to the elements, to the sun, to the wave action, to the tides, to the currents, the behavior and characteristics of that oil start to change. Um, our overflights are continuously monitoring what that offshore condition looks like and what the oil looks like. And, and we are seeing trends that indicate um, fewer and farther between lighter sheen, less heavy oil. Right. We continue to see as we do these daily continuous assessments, uh, oil on the beaches in the form of tall tar balls and patties, so anything from one inches to a few inches of oil that, that usually is a bit sticky, covered in sand, uh, and needs to be manually removed. And as long as that's there, uh, we continue to pick it up. And, and uh, you know, I mentioned we have 800, 800 plus uh, personnel working on this today, uh, on the water, on the beaches, and, uh, and, and, and intend to and continue to increase that until we know there's no oil on the beach.